so in this lecture we are going to learn about to how to customize your text out. i mean how to change your wallpaper the grouping of icons shorting and these are the theme important things to organize your desktop so let's come on the desktop see we have this wallpaper you know to change a wallpaper just right click and there is option to change a wallpaper so mac by default will you know give you these options to to a, use a dynamic desktop okay these are the downloaded one here you see icon that means you need to download it that means you need a internet connection to download or to use this wallpaper okay for example if i'll use this okay it will download and it's it will apply okay like this if i click here you see it's downloaded already so it will change my text top okay the skin we have like this dark light okay dynamic and same for the light and dark text tops you can use the picture you can use the color scheme you see colors or you can use the auto rotate so it will automatically rotate a color in every 30 second you can say the random then it will play randomly from this okay and if you want to use your own wallpaper i mean if you have wallpaper so just go to the location of your wallpaper like this if i have a, uh, my wallpaper like here okay right click and click on the image you see no uh, like this click and set desktop picture and my picture is set okay and you can see like here to fit to screen okay stretch to fill center you will see here if there is a change okay so there is a no change so you learned not able to see otherwise see in the fill screen and center there is a difference a little difference so that's how you can change your wallpaper okay and if you want to show this thing like on the alphabetical order so what you do just right click group group is basically to group a file like like did a grouping for a similar kind of file okay and you can do like the date modified so all the file you will get as per the date okay grouping is basically see there is the file like mov mov so all the mov files will combine if i will do a kind okay that's a grouping if you do a tags i mean if you assign a tag then it will automatically uh, group a file on the basis of the tags okay and you can do a use tag if you don't use a tag it will not group okay see if you don't use a tag then I mean, you will get this option short by. Short by is basically to a by name. If I will do by name, see the files will be arranged as per the name. Okay. If you do a by size, then this file will be arranged on the basis of the size. Okay. For example, you see the customize the doc will. If I got to get info, you will get a file size is it's a hundred MB. Okay. And if I go to the next one, that is the next one. Then you see it's a 570 MB. Okay, here if you check this spotlight, it's a 60 MB. Okay, so it's down like this one is definitely uh, smaller than this file up top one 503. Okay, and this one is smaller than 503. See, so it will arrange a file on the basis of the size. If I use a stack, then it will all grouping but short by is not here okay so that's how you can use but if you use a stack you can give a so view option the show view option you will get a like a option how to view this thing i mean there is a grading space you can maintain okay if you want to change the size okay the text size you know icon size if you increase it you see on the top icon size okay i'll show you see here if you change here see the icon size will increase okay or you can increase the space between the this one okay so view option basically it will work on the basis of the images okay you can do group by short by you can the text size for example is the 15 you can see 
tax size increased okay label is bottom or right for example it's a right then all the label will go to the right by default is a bottom okay if you show info then it will show the image size i mean it, what, what is the pixel of the image okay preview icon will show you the pre icon otherwise it will show you a default icon okay background you can set a background any picture you want color okay any image like here you can drag and drop like this okay it will place see you get an image so we prefer a default one and if you ch and change any setting you can use a def use as default so it will change every setting as a default okay so that's all what we have to customize the desktop options